Majesties, Louis, King by right of arms of the Middle Kingdom, and Saif, our Queen of War and Song. Good morning, everybody. Welcome to our crown tournament. Looks like a beautiful day. Let's uh, get started. Master Borland, please. Your Majesty, these are the combatants and their consorts for your crown tournament. Viscount Kith von Atzinger shall be fighting for Duchess Ariane Wynn Firk Morgan. Of bright Ariane Wynn I now speak, the fair Duchess whom the light doth seek, a five-petaled rose beyond critique, riding proudly on a horse so sleek, thus impressing all with her technique. Dawn brings us this rider of the West, with justice bold on her banner's crest, and a mark of service on her chest. With a welcome heart and welcome hands, she is a beacon throughout the lands. Consort, you are grace, you are the light, your loyal heart guides his every fight. Thus, until I have gone on, I will never see a dawn without praise to set upon Arianwan Bark Vaughn. Nice. <laughs> Count Nikolai Grigorovich Petrov, fighting for Countess Serena Kimbowite and Cleo Faithful Companion. <laughs> Glory! All hail Serena, Countess of the Dragon! She has ruled the mid realm, yes, and her champions proclaim her still. But more does she rule Nikolai's heart. See true <coughs> devotion in his eyes. Serena plants the crafter's dreams. Tends the tournament of the arts, sets aside spaces so artisans shine. She graces saddle as sister, not mistress. Losha graces at her whisper. Mother of silkworms is she, reeling soft fibers finer than flax. Tell her truth or keep silent, for her lips do not know lies. So fools and foes alike beware, she will shake you. <laughs> Count William of Fairhaven shall be fighting for Countess Isolde de la Remey. <clears throat> my queen, you are. My queen, you have always been. My queen, you are the completion of me, my balance. My queen, strong is your love for this kingdom. My queen, strong is your love for the people of this kingdom. My queen, your life's worth is now the rest of mine combined. My queen, you are intelligent, compassionate, and with humor. My queen, your reign would be thoughtful with fairness and the inclusion of all. My queen, you work tirelessly for the people and the kingdom. My queen, I shall fight for you again for the joy of having you reign beside me. Count Seto Geshuko, fighting for Astamari Zarya Tesfaye.
sword he will provide, a gleaming golden crown too bright for eyes, gracious, tenacious, joyful, bear Narelle. With salacious, savage wit, her charms avow, she will ever skillfully woo the wise, as combatants verily come and die, Jaguar defends. Let each pounce ferocious before this crowd, leading nope, audacious, stop, graceful, please. and highbrow. The next beloved queen of land and sky will take her gilded throne and by the by. Behold your next resplendent queen, Norel. Jaguar defends! Jaguar defends! Master Elf of King's Crossing, fighting for Mistress Gwyneth von Peebler. on the table, here is Gwyneth, <laughs> keeping rapier's health stable, able Gwyneth. A graceful, kind, royal presence, queenly Gwyneth. Her service will show us Constance, pleasant Gwyneth. Mistress Constanza de Mendoza <laughs> shall be fighting for Baron Sir Caleb McCady. Sir Crispin, to become our queen of love and beauty. 
sing the praises of Gianna, most skilled in graceful dance and scribal arts. Her acts of service stand apart, of noble bearing, kind and good will. A reign of love she seeks to start, for truly she has a dragon's heart. Side. 
not just cheese, no, but also wisdom, great interest in her people, crafts of all kinds, whether food, cloth, or knowledge, all a bounty from which others can learn. And beside her, standing proud, hand folding over her own a stalwart champion, her heart and love shine through him as his eyes look upon her and smile, Creva embracing her with love. Baron Miles Longfellow, fighting for Maestra Katayun Al Arvatasba. service in the dream? Will her kindness help to bring our dragon kingdom great esteem? Such a person we can find in someone like no other, Ariane Wintriana, thoughtful woman and scholar. She welcomes newcomers, fostering their fresh findings. She encourages Dawood, the man who would be king. Lord Algar Ironhand! Fighting for the Honorable Lady Shona Ingen Gregor.
teaching word. The wealth of the barony is increased by three skills. The making of fine clothing, the scribing of fair documents, the brewing of good ale. A wise person may give three treasures to a kingdom. The skilled hand of art, the open heart of love, quiet words of good counsel. Three words on the name one worthy grace the dragon throne. Shona Ing and Kriaga. Lord Andreas Renardi shall be fighting for Lady Crescento de Depre. The facets of Crescentome inspire Andreas towards the throne. Too many for one book to say. The facets of Crescentome. Honorus, Equitas, Verite, Baker, Archer, Scribe, Help Meets Own. The facets of Crescentome inspire Andreas towards the throne. Sergeant Avangar Havardson, fighting for Lady Adeline La Savonnière. In the tournament's arena, my Avignard stands tall, a beacon of protection, my heart's eternal thrall. With each swing of his sword, my worries start to fall, but in his strength and valor, I find solace over all. His gaze, unwavering, meets mine with steadfast grace, a promise of devotion, a love that can't erase. He fights with noble passion, a gallant, timeless chase. Avignar, my warrior, my sacred heart's embrace. In every clash and parry, my spirit soars with pride, for I am his consort, forever by his side. In this grand arena where destiny shall decide, Avignar, my warrior, with you, my heart is tied. Your Majesty. These are the contestants and their consorts that are vying to be your heirs on this day. Their Majesties call forward any members of the Order of Chivalry who wish to give their fealty at this time. I here swear fealty and do homage to the crown of the Middle Kingdom, to ever be a good knight and true, reverend and generous, shield of the weak, obedient to my liege lord, foremost in battle, Courteous at all times, champion of the right and the good, thus swear I, Sir Thomas Cornell. This do we hear and shall never forget to be your liege lord, rewarding fealty with love, valor with honor, and oath breaking with vengeance. Your Majesties call forward any members of the Masters of Defense who wish to swear their fealty. This do we hear and shall never forget, nor fail to reward that which is given. Fealty with love, service with honor, oath breaking with vengeance. Your Majesties invite any combatants and their consorts who wish to swear fealty at this time. This is obviously to both of them, so this was not the truth. I'm going to clean it up. Exactly. Serve where serve I might. Serve where serve I might. Serve where serve I might. I'm like you said, it's not. This do we hear and shall never forget. Fail to reward that which is given. Fealty with love, service with honor, and oath breaking with justice. Good gentles, do you affirm that each of you and your prospective consorts have read and understood the corpora of the Society of Creative Anachronism and the laws of the Middle Kingdom? Aye! We've read it all between the gentles. <laughs> have you all read and do you understand the rules of the list and the Convention to Combat of the Middle Kingdom? Aye! Aye. Aye. 
Do you understand and agree, and do you agree to assume the possible risk of injury arising directly or indirectly out of combat-related activities? Uh, yeah. We are going to be having a short martial and combatant meeting after this. <laughs> Good gentles, you know well that the one for whom you fight is the personification, personification of all honor, respect, and truth, the living representation of that love which is worthy of honor, not only now, but in all times and in all seasons. Therefore, today you fight in these lists not to gain power for yourself, nor for your own glory and honor, but for the honor and greater glory of the one whose favor you bear upon the field. By your valor, skill, and courtesy will you advance that person's honor, and the one to whom victory is given this day shall declare the name of that person for all to know and crown that person as royal consort to reign alongside after ascending the throne of the Middle Kingdom. You have heard the reason of our lists. Do you, each of you today have an inspiration whose favor advance and whom you may crown as royal consort. Aye. Aye. Should you prove victorious upon the field. <laughs> <laughs> then bear your favors bravely into the lists, either in victory or in honorable defeat. As you join the list, hear these words, keep them in your heart, and keep honor in your blades. Bow to the crown, and bow to the throne, and bow to the one whose favor you own. Remember their eyes are watching the fray, so bow to each other and fight as you may. Honor the crown and think on their duty, the champions of right and of all we should be. The greatest of burdens, the highest renown, the first ones to rise and the last to lie down. Bow to the crown and bow to the throne and bow to the one whose favor you own. Remember their eyes are watching the fray, so bow to each other and fight as you may. Honor the one favor you bear and strive in their honor to ever be fair. Think on their fate when battle's begun and let them be proud of whatever you Bow to the king, bow to the throne, and bow to the one whose favor you own. Remember their eyes are watching the fray, so bow to each other and fight as you may. Honor your foe and keep your reign true. Remember they fight with the same heart as you. Trust in their judgment whatever you throw, for theirs is a part of the power you show. Bow to the crown, bow to the throne, bow to the one whose favor you own. Remember their eyes are watching the fray, so bow to each other and fight as you may. Bow to the crown, bow to the throne, and bow to the one whose favor you own. Remember their eyes are watching the fray. Bow to each other and fight as you may. Bow to each other and fight as you may. To the bar! Draco! Marshals to the center of the field. <laughs>